and we're live. I was, I'm still upset about him dying. Like he was someone I didn't expect to die at this point in time. Every once in a blue moon, you're like, oh, not that celebrity. Mm -hmm. Oh, like I, I was using that one. Yeah, <laughs> <Who do you laughs> want? that's the one I like. Everybody yeah. always talks about the ones that, that affect them. Who do we want to die? Uh, well, like whoever Ooh. the biggest like producer rapists are, probably. But I guess they're well, not actors, pretty, so that's pretty fair. Count. They got mm -hmm. them all. <laughs> hmm. no. I don't know who. Who are you thinking? You kick it Cosby's off. Cosby's so back out. Oh. Oh yeah. No, no. Don't waste a vote on him. He's like a hundred. Like okay. that's gonna okay. solve itself. <laughs> it will. Look at it. I have said it before. He has the. Uh, he has the eyes of a nineteen-year-old lab. <laughs> just cloudy horrible <laughs> raping <laughs> eyes <laughs> i think i've had enough of ozzy osbourne i think it's time like, i don't like, want him to die though like like he's done nothing besides like bumble his way through english for the last 20 years so i don't think he's yeah I unless think he's, i'm unknowing no i i think he's mostly dead already yeah. like he's pretty fried like a princess bride <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah he's okay. mostly dead but I mean, what? Why do you not like Ozzy Osbourne? Do you feel like every what you time I see him on camera, he's just like, "Oh yeah, there's that one time back in the seventies with Sharon and then lots of us." <laughs> like, Wait, what did you say? And like the yeah. the guy who makes so makes the caption is that? well, I yeah. just had enough of it. Just had enough. <laughs> had right? enough of it. Fuck him. Okay, so Ozzy Osbourne number one. You don't like him. Huh. I do like him. Anyone just more, uh, more relevant? But <laughs> that's not great. Chris Brown is my celebrity. I want to die. I know. We yeah, you know what? I'll back you on that one. Uh, that's a solid one. Uh, he's still beating women to this day, isn't he? Yeah. yeah. Probably. He, 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 you know, Allegedly. he didn't. He didn't let pop culture stop him from what he loves to do. <laughs> you know what? I lied. <laughs> they can only cancel you if you stop hitting women. John Jones fits <laughs> this bill. I know he's kind of interesting to have on our TV. Undefeated. Kyle's not gonna uh, he just took he just took another one out. <laughs> he is undefeated pretty much. He, I I have him losing two fights, but on the scorecard, whatever. Anyway, uh he beats women and cheats and, and he beats women and wins. Well, of course yeah. he does. He's well, a Chris fighter. Brown, if you could uh if you want to use that measure, Chris Brown, I think, is also an undefeated. I think fighter. she got in some shots. <laughs> so? Bill Burr, is he the one that had that routine? Like yeah. Yeah, yes. or was it Chris Rock? Maybe it was Bill, Bill Burr. Burr. Maybe. Yeah, he, he's asking <clears> like, <throat> "All right, all right, I'm not for beating women, but what did you? Does anyone think she came out with an apron on? Cookies are ready, and then he started beating her. <laughs> What'd she do? <laughs> that, that's when, like, yeah, he did that bit where he's like, "They're they're saying there's no reason to hit a woman. There is no reason. He's like, really? Yeah. No reason ever." Like and he's like mad about it. Yeah, that was that was pre as famous as he is now, Bill Burr, when he could get away that, with, that with a little pre. with a lot more. Yeah, he's uh, he has had a long career. Like I, I would say, mm -hmm. a long good career. I, in my mind, sure. when I see him do interviews and stuff, he's still killing it. I don't know that I've seen a special that is as good as the old ones, but still good. Take anyone else who's reached his level of high, like Chris Rock. Louis Norm McDonald. Mm. Okay. Uh, That's Norm the only McDonald. one that I because he just died. He's at the front He's of my a head. has been, dude. He's a well. has been since two weeks ago. <laughs> oh. When he dies. Yeah. What's he done lately? I mean, no, Norm never <laughs> decompose. Norm never got to the level of fame Bill Burr got to. Like really? I mean, you could say like weekend update and stuff like that, but and he the always Norm show. Yeah, the Norm show. Like he was always more like like he wouldn't. St the reason he got fired from SNL is because he would like lie and say, and, and "Yeah, like, I'm not going to make any of more of those jokes about OJ." And then he'd go out there and be like, "Anybody notice that OJ is murdering people, and he's getting <laughs> away with it?" Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All I those love the OJ great. bits. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, what was I going to say about Bill Burr? Oh, Bill and Burr. somehow he managed to get like uh, on two of the coolest TV shows ever, right? With uh, Breaking Bad and The Mandalorian. Like, like, how did he manage that? He's, I, I think that's the only two times he's acted. He did really well in Breaking Bad. I haven't Definitely seen The Mandalorian with him. Only two. I, I, I know he's on. He owned Family Guy. No. What is this show called? Oh, F is for um, Family. He, he does F a voice on an animated show. Yeah. I he's the lead. That. That okay. Sucks. That's, that's a terrible show. Yeah, it's not good, unfortunately. But I, had such I, heard him, I heard him talking about that, and he's he just feels really fortunate. It wasn't really planned. He just landed on shows that happened to be huge hits. Hmm. Yeah, well, I mean, Bill Burr was in Chappelle's show. 
It's true as well. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he's ordering the beer. Uh, he's in that sketch. and it, the Samuel set, Jackson, Jackson beer. beer! It gets you drunk! <laughs> oh, man, that was Why are you yelling? <laughs> why, why are you yelling? <laughs> oh, he was in The Simpsons. Who is a, who's a celebrity? Like, obviously, for, I think, Kyle and I, Norm dying, we really were, were sad about that. Who's another one that if they died, you would actually care? Clint, Clint Eastwood. Oh, be, that's a terrible pick. He's like 97. So, that, I, so I'm still going to be bummed out, man. He just made another movie. I heard it was bad. Well, he's 90 fucking thousand years old. <laughs> like, 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 of course, they're going to be bad. The, the way like <laughs> uh, it's advertised, it's called Cry Macho, and I keep scrolling past it because I heard it was bad. And it's like, he's too old to be playing. A he looks guy. so feeble. He does. Yeah, he. yeah. like, And he's he's like probably the fittest 90 three-year-old oh, 100%, out yeah. there and even then it just shows like yeah you can't escape age this guy did everything right he's got great genes and genetics and at 93 he's like just a, a shadow is robert redford dead i don't I think don't so know. he's so you guys were young when his career was booming he was an a-list a-list mm -hmm. and uh i watched him get like he like lost his looks and he's mm -hmm. old, and then he got real skinny, and it's one of the few. That was the first celebrity I saw go from Hollywood's leading man to aged out in the same way that Clint did. He's still alive. Yeah, he's eighty five. Eighty five. He's alive. alive. Yeah. I, I, oh yeah, I, he did look. He was fucking hot when he was younger. Now and he looked. He is hot. not. Oh, I'm looking at old pictures of him. Yeah, he was well, he was like mega super hot when he was younger. I'm getting a little yeah. too into it's it. It's interesting the guys that want to retire early and the guys who want to just do it until they drop dead like Clint Eastwood cuz like Gene Hackman quit decades ago. Yeah, but it's it's like I, I you know, you get that type of person. I guess you could say the same with fucking like YouTube or any creative, right? Some people are just going to live and breathe it no matter what until they die even if it's like 20 years of making nothing of success and then others are going to be like all right, well, that was good. I'm. I think I'm in, enough of that. I'm gonna do something else. Who's the Rick Moranis? He's one of my my these neat stories. It, if people don't know, Rick Moranis was this huge star. He played this nerdy guy. Uh, his biggest hit was probably Honey, I Shrunk the Kids, and then Great his film. wife died, and he just retired for like 20 years to raise the kids, and then he came back a little bit. They're like, Honey, I raised the kids, and you know, like it, he just decided to be a stay-at-home dad because financially yeah. you could do it and they I, needed it i liked that story about him because i've heard that too i thought that was like a cool thing to do like okay yeah. well there's a higher calling than pretending to shrink children what was the someone other one? uh oh. someone attacked him the other day in, in new york i think rick, rick moranis yeah Rick why would they? Why? Did they hate the movie that much? <laughs> they had... They you had should never shrink your own children! <laughs> I was really the hand. <laughs> Rick Moranis. Assault. <laughs> assault. I, that is, that, I hope it's targeted. Video I mean, shows I man assaulting Rick Moranis. What the fuck? How could you assault this man? He looks like a, um, Alton Brown, I, but like I, not. I'm on the other side. Anyone could assault this man. Okay, I I meant not. I didn't mean could you. I just meant why would you? This How is like beating I? up a third grader. Could do it with one arm. Jeez, I could probably beat him up. <laughs> oh my I goodness! So. It's a it's a guy just in all black, wearing an I love New York hoodie, and out of nowhere he's just passing him. There's no nothing exchanged, and he just whoa, just just decks him way, into like the side it. of a building for why no reason. Why are they reason. filming? Uh, it's a security cam that they're uh, oh. that. So this it is, was potentially a yeah. completely random. It looks totally random, but it, yeah, on NBC News that it says video shows man assault Rick Moranis on NYC Street. That's the name of it, and it's out of no. That's scary to just right? be doing your thing and then you're like assaulted. Did you guys have the mean, knockout game? Yeah, of course. This, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. So I don't know if it was YouTube a media videos. creation or if it actually became a trend, but people would just go for like a one hit knockout on total strangers and uh at the time the knockout game was getting media attention i was training and i thought like oh i dare to try it on me bring that noise here <laughs> i'd probably just get knocked out i mean yeah right <laughs> oh, boy, of course you would you, you would be looking at your phone walking down the street yeah, and someone right? would run up behind <laughs> you and knock you like 
I mean, but if you participate in something like time, that, it was you're, like, Come bring it to try me, you're, try you're, me. You're a truly despicable person to do something like that.